Hi, this is Jesse with DiscGolfMonkeys.com. We did a Dying Disc video and we got some comments that Rit Die was no longer working in Dying Disc well. So we decided to investigate. I went out and I bought some new Rit Die and tried to dye my Force. Just threw a quick one on there. And as you can see, it's very gray, light, transparent, did not work. And that was actually sitting on the heat for about an hour in the dye and it just did not take. So. We explored some alternatives and we think we found a couple. Number one, the easy one, go down to Walmart and in the craft section they have this Dylon die. Uh, it did work fine. I thought it works um, maybe just a little bit less than well than, than the old RIT did, but it still it'll get the job done. The other one we had to order off the internet. This is this Jackard I Dye Poly and it is designed to dye rayon and nylon so we figured it would work well on plastic and sure enough uh, this stuff dies dark. Here is a champion monarch I threw a little dye on and as you can see that is black. Never seen a dye dye that black and that was only 10 minutes sitting in the pan. Now the eye dye is a little different than the RIT. It's not a powdered form that you pour out of the box. There's a little dissolvable bag that you put in the hot water and then there's a little pouch of color intensifier. And I poured that in, used it, and it, it worked great. One side note, um, the pan that I use is enameled steel. And the dye actually dyed my enamel a little bit. My pan did not wash out clean. So if you're using this stuff indoors, be very careful. Uh, it could dye something you don't intend to dye. Also, because this is so powerful, I would not leave my disc sitting in it for too long. The dye actually can bleed all the way through the disc and then you'll very quickly have a design that gets fuzzy and faded out at the edges and you don't want that. So, two great alternatives. Oh, the camera was rolling!